see you on the other side. Andrew's mind seems to be crumbling under the mirror's influence. We need to stop him before he drags Edward's corrupted soul back into this world. I still cannot quite believe what is happening in this strangest of places. You will need to stay calm when we talk to Lady Margaret again. I know, I know. She's just so... Infuriating, yes. But we need to know everything her husband might have revealed to her. Agreed. This isn't him. No, my Edward couldn't have written this. It's marked somewhere around Australia or Tasmania. What does the mark mean, do you think? I'm not sure. But I think I've seen a similar globe in the master study. How do you feel about your darling husband now? David, that's not helping. My Edward wouldn't. He couldn't have written this. It must have been Andrew. Or, or young Eddie. Yes, yes, that's who it was. Not Edward. Not my Edward. Do you know how Andrew got through the passage in the fireplace? No, I don't know. I thought I heard him sneaking about the Great Hall before he came into Eddie's room, but I cannot be sure. I know this is difficult to hear, but there is a madness cursing through the Gordon bloodline, and you know it. You've seen it tear our family apart. Andrew is the outcome of this madness, the result of what your husband did to Cecilia. No. He would have never touched her. Never. Would you like to sit down, Lady Margaret? No, no. I'm all right. It's just... He was always good to me. He did love me. In his way. Listen to me, Lady Margaret. This is important. Rory said there is something unresolved between my father and I. Do you know what he meant? I didn't know your father as well as I would have liked. I'm sorry, I... This is not the time for secrets, Lady Margaret. Just look at what this has brought us. I'm sorry. All that is happening... It makes no sense. All I can tell you is that your father was obsessed with the model of the castle in the Master's study. I have avoided that room for years. We need to get moving. Andrew could be doing anything to Eddie right now. Young Eddie doesn't deserve this. You need to save him. We'll try. You have our word. Is there anything you know about your husband? Something that could help us save Eddie's life? I don't know what it is, but I do know that Edward considered it valuable. what had to be done for our family. What else could I have done? Oh. Ah!
Let's see if my trusty key will get this open. The final part. Stop your whining! You are seeing something again, aren't you? Yes. Give it back! You, you, you killed her! It's your fault! So that's why he buried it in Cecilia's grave. Switch. He's in the grip of the mirror. What did you see, David? My father. Uh, and Edward, he... It's all right. Take your time. Margaret covered up the fact that Edward didn't die by accident. He was murdered. Murdered? By whom? My father. Your father? Are you sure? He would have only been a child then. I am sure. Then yes, he was. Lady Margaret sent him to boarding school soon afterwards. She was scared of him. And I suppose that's why she was afraid of me too. All this time, trying to prove my father wasn't mad. That every man in the Gordon family isn't destined to become a murderer. But that's exactly what he was. He was only a child. Maybe the mirror drove him to it. It did. I saw, I, I saw the darkness take hold of him. But does it matter though? Like Rory said, it doesn't wash away the guilt. Sooner or later, I will be shedding innocent blood, too. I shouldn't follow Andrew down there. I could end up a monster like every Gordon before me. And you should go. Just get yourself away from all this. Nonsense. You're the only one who can stop Andrew. You're armed with the knowledge your father never had. And remember, he did everything in his power to protect you. He sacrificed himself. He saw the horrors on the other side. And still did it. Now that you know the things that happened to him when he was a child. <sighs> you are right. He wasn't the father I needed in life. But in death, he gave everything for a mere chance to protect me. I forgive you. Thank you for everything. Now let us stop this madness once and for all. Margaret covered it up. She even lied about Edward's death. 
She told everyone it was an unfortunate accident. Here's another one. Like the one in the old wing, but the marking runs through Spain. Locked. Yes, perfect. Look. A stone plate full of ancient symbols. A stone plate full of ancient symbols.
There's something back there. Looks like a door. A door? Where to? Well, that's what we need to find out. Andrew clearly wants us to follow him. Mainly you, I reckon. <laughs> the first one worked, but what is the second one? The first one worked, but what is the second one? You did it! I just hope we are not too late. After you. Too kind. David, stop! Don't move! What? What's wrong? Can't you see? Right by your feet! An abyss! An abyss? What are you talking about? I'll guide you across. Just listen to my voice. One step back, then to your left. Please be careful! Stop. Turn to your right and move forward slowly. Stop. Turn to your right and move forward slowly. Stop. Turn to your left, then straight. But be careful! Ooh, that was too close. Leah? Careful. Thank God this is over. I really hope this is you, Father. Rory was right. We can only get through this together. Just as well I can see it. Leah! Oh, damn it, it's not moving! Leah! Oh, damn it, it's not moving! What the...
это? I can't reach the statue, but my reflection. Hmm. I can't reach the. Your cheap tricks will not stop me. What the? Your cheap tricks will not stop me. What the? Your cheap tricks will not stop me. You want me to use this, father. But what for? The same symbols as in the village, and the gate. Damn, I must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. That's one. I can't reach the statue, but my reflection, hmm. I think I got everything I need from in there. I think I got everything I need from in there. Whatever this place is, someone or something wants to keep me out. Too late.
Lord David! I'm delighted you could join us. I knew you'd find your way here. Let the others go, Andrew. This is a family matter. Amongst us true Gordons. You are so right, my dear cousin. This is a family matter. David! David. David. If you think your cheap tricks can stop me, you're greatly mistaken. Get a grip, David. Master David, why did you let me die? You have disgraced this family. I should have killed you when I had the chance, boy. You're not seeing the bigger picture, David. This family, this clan, was once powerful enough to drive the Roman legions out of Scotland. We can have that power again! Massacring an entire village of innocents in the process. I want that as much as you, Andrew. But do you really think you can control the thing Edward has become? You were always a disappointment to me. You are nothing! Less than nothing! What do you need me to do to complete the ritual and bring Edward back? Not much. Just a few drops of your blood. Give me the knife. I'll do it myself. David, my dearest cousin, you really need to stop treating me like I'm bloody stupid! My father, could he be brought back too? Pure Gordon blood flows through my veins. Once my father is freed, there will be nothing we cannot do. Very well. Together then. David, don't! Shut your mouth, woman!
Rest in peace, Rory. If such a thing is possible. What? You, you doubt it? All that happened here? I am a scientist. I never thought there was an afterlife or anything after. And now, I know there's not only life after death, but there's evil there. My father, Rory, they saved us. And I must believe they found their peace. It's up to us to find our own. And hope that it lasts.
ukaini horon.